Falls before everyone's moon fizzled. If the town's under Luna Girl's control, we'll be way outnumbered. Hey, how about we use these bins? Yeah! Yay! Huh? They may be dangerous, but who says I can't have a little fun? Ready? Batter up! Supercomputer destroyed. Nice of Romeo to build these statues of us. PJ Mass all shout hooray! Cause in the night we save the day! The seeds! They've been released! And it's all my fault! Too bad, PJ Pest! Luna Girl's going to get her moon garden. It'll grow over the whole city and destroy all the other plants. I couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> She's right. I should have asked you to help. But I wanted to show I knew about gardening, even though I didn't go to that club. It's okay, Owlette. Any ideas now? I'm listening. I really am. Thinking, thinking. Those seeds are everywhere. Oh! They just go wherever the wind blows. Wait, that's a great idea, Gecko. Wherever the wind blows. All we have to do is get the wind blowing in the right direction. I know what to do, but I'm going to need all the gardening help I can get. What's the plan? Come with me. It's time to be a hero! 
Ready, Gecko? It's time for Operation Weed Wind. Back to the park. Huh? What? Where is it? Let's check out the owl glider. Oh no, the owl glider's gone too. And so is the gecko mobile. Okay, how are we going to be heroes without our vehicles? Um, maybe we could use our bikes. Our bikes? It's worth a try. You're good on yours. My bike's okay for the daytime, but heroes need supercars to stop crime. I say we try it. At least until we find out who's got our vehicles. Come on! I can't believe we're gonna be heroes on bikes. Come on, Catboy! It'll be fun! Yeah! Look! I can super lizard grip on my bike! And never worry about falling off. You should try flying with yours, Owlette. Okay, here goes! graceful landing I've ever made. Hey, Catboy, you should try your super skills on your bike, too. This is great. I guess, but it's not as cool as my cat car. Come on, let's just get to the park. Whoa! Look at this weird wall of cars. And there's a noise coming from inside. Okay, let's check it out. Romeo, how did you get our super vehicles out of HQ? Easy. I was using my amazing electromagnet to get some of these daytime cars, but then it sucked your vehicles right out, too. Our vehicles weren't yours to take. Oh, is that why you're stuck riding your silly little bikes? What? Who, me? Oh, boo-hoo. Look, Romeo, you can't just steal cars, and you certainly can't keep our super vehicles. Why do you need all three, anyway? I don't. I'll try them all and keep the best one. Ah! I am the best pop star! I can't believe he thinks he's a pop star. We'll play a much nicer concert up on stage tomorrow. Us? Up on stage? <laughs> Did you tie it to all of the instruments? Uh, I think so. Then I'll get Gekko to pull them up. Messing around and get ready for my smashing finale. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I was thinking about tomorrow again, and I must have tied the rope all wrong. Pop star, pop star, pop star! If he keeps singing, he'll blow that glass ceiling and every window in the city. He'll be so proud, he'll never stop singing. I have to stop worrying about playing in front of everyone. I'm gonna choose an instrument. It's time to be a hero. Super cat speed! Huh? Oh, everyone's watching! <laughs> hey, this isn't so bad. What are you doing behind here? Nigelinos! I can't be a pop star without my band. Get over here! <laughs> it's showtime, Ninjalinos. <laughs> pop star, pop star, pop star! Enough! <laughs> huh? Yeah! <laughs> We're going reptiles! We're too high! Right. 
right. Careful. Whoa! Yes! I'll just bring it down slowly. Way to go! I knew you'd get the hang of it. See? You just had to give it a try. Yeah! Mutt! Let me go, you PJ pests! It's over, Luna girl. Yeah, we've got your Luna board, so you can't steal any more presents. Oh! Oh, it's not fair! I never get a real Christmas! I'm just here by myself. What? You mean you're all alone at Christmas? But that's really sad. Hey, why don't you spend the rest of Christmas Eve with us? With you? Yeah, we've got to put all these presents and decorations back anyway. You can help. Then we'll all have Christmas together. What do you say? Okay, I guess. Then hop on, we're going to save Christmas! Yay! Gecko. Thanks. Now that I have the hang of it, I love it. You really helped us out, Luna Girl, so you can have your board and magnet back. Why would Luna Girl take butterflies? Why not something cool and tough? Like a lion! Owl eyes! <laughs> It must have escaped from Luna Girl. Let's try and get it to follow us. Hey, butterfly, wanna fly with me? Come on, we'll take you home. Huh? Great colors, little butterfly. Which of mine do you like? This one or this one? This is taking too long. What we need is some super cat speed. Hey, what happened to the... Gotcha. You were really rough, Catboy. Let it out. You're making it unhappy. But this is the best way to get it home. And there are more to catch. Look! Okay, but let us try and help these ones. Come on, fly over here. Yeah, come on. Do you like red, green, blue, or all of them? <gasps> Super Cat Speed! One and two! I'm getting good at this. What? Catboy, can't you be gentle? You're making those butterflies really miserable. But I'm helping them. Now, where's Luna Girl with the others? Hey, look! Aren't those her moths? Fly away! I don't need you anymore. Come on, PJ Masks! Let's go! Plan. Let's wait for the moths at the toy shop and stop them there. And whoever uses the coolest superhero moves to get there wins. Another competition? We don't want to. Oh, come on. Not afraid to lose, are you? Who, me? No. Maybe Gecko is. Hey, no, I'm not. I've got some amazing superhero moves. But are they better than mine? Maybe. We'd better find out. Warm up all you want. But my superhero moves will be both of you. Ready? Ready. Ready. Then let the best superhero win! Check out my super flying move! Nice, but check out my super lizard grip! <sighs> They're nothing next to my super cat jumps!
Time to let the cat out of the bag. Super cat speed! Super cat muscle! Hey, that's not fair either! Super cat jump! Now that's how to win. My superhero moves were definitely the best. No way! My moves were way cooler, so I win. I'd say my superhero moves are the best, so I win again! No one can compare to me! I'm Owlet the winner! Huh? Gecko? Catboy? Catboy! <gasps> hey! Oh no! Luna Girls got them! Oh, if I hadn't kept trying to beat them, then we'd still be together. Hey! Time to be a hero! Looks like Luna Girl doesn't want any of this stuff anymore. I don't know why anyone wouldn't want this cat. Let's just get it all back to class. Then everyone will be happy again. Except me. My giving out was not here. I'm going in to get it back. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. There's some kind of force field here. I'm going to need your help getting my statue. Are you sure you don't want to give it away? Luna Girl stole my statue. She doesn't deserve to keep it. Okay, you make her come out. I'll see if I can force my way inside. Hey, Luna Girl! You're interrupting me adoring my beautiful moon sculpture. It's an owl sculpture, and you stole it. No, I was sure you gave it to me. No way, it's mine. But it suits me better, so I should have it. Go on, say it's mine. Say it! Okay, Super Gecko Muscles! Huh? Wriggling reptiles! What's up? <gasps> Gecko! Ha! Lizard Boys had a taste of my force field freeze. No one gets in my Luna Lair. And no one takes my moon sculpture from me. Because it's mine. Mine! 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 You're not going to have it for long. Luna Girl, you win. The statue's yours. We're leaving. I knew you'd come to your senses in the end. What about Gecko? We'll get him free and get my statue back, too. You just need to run down the fire escape and then back up the inside stairs to come out that door, okay? If you think that'll work. Go, Catboy. Show him what you can do. <laughs> Puppet show ever. Whoa. Nice going, lizard boy. Huh? <gasps> okay, here's the plan. Gecko? Gecko, are you okay? Yeah, but get the puppets. PJ Masks to the rescue. Super Cat Speed! Get them, Moth! <laughs> Owl Wing Wing! Good job, PJ Masks. Are the puppets okay? Yeah, but Cameron's not. We left him because we thought you were in danger. Who's Cameron? I was just trying to get the puppets back. What's Cameron doing here? Who's Cameron? He's sleepwalking. Who's Cameron? We have to help him get home. Yeah, he needs our help more than the puppets. Who's Cameron? <laughs> I bet he'd make a great puppet. She's going to wake him. Let's stop her. Don't just throw the puppets on the floor. Look how great they are. That's it, puppets. Do a little dance, then wave to my friends. Stay back, Luna Girl. You shouldn't wake a sleepwalker. Maybe I won't wake him, but I will play with him. Come to Luna Girl, Puppet Boy. No. Oh. I'll be right there, guys. Come on, puppets. I have to go and help my friends. He's mine now. Super Owl Wing! Super Cat Jump! Oh, you got me, snoring boy! <laughs> well, if it isn't the cunning chameleon, too bad you're too late. Watch as I carve my beautiful face into the moon. Super Gecko Muscles! Whoa! Just me and my 
my super gecko muscle! <laughs> I've got a leaping lab and a robot! There's no way you peewee masks can stop me! You're outmatched! You're right. Distracting you is just part one of my plan. Part two is my backup! Didn't expect this, did ya? You're working with Luna Girl? She wants to stop you as much as we do. Leave the moon alone, Romeo. It's mine! Never! Looks like it's time for part three of the plan, Luna Girl. You got it. Take a attack! <laughs> stop! Stop her, robot! <laughs> ha! No one escapes my Luna Beam. Not even you, robot. Affirmative. The moss, Luna Girl, Romeo, and the robot are all busy. Now for the next step of my plan. Super Gecko Muscles! <laughs> Got it! <laughs> I, I can't need my laser without that telescope. Okay, no more laughing fun. Shoo! Shoo moss! Hey, watch where you're going, Leaping Lab! Get the telescope, robot! Too late, robot. Super Cat Speed! Cannot compute, cannot compute. Ooh. It can't be! It's over, Romeo. The telescope can't help you now. We took you down. One step at a time. I've still got my space laser! <laughs> what are you doing, you fool? Let it go! If you say so. Super cat huh? If we free my copies, there'll be enough of us to beat the robots. Any ideas how, team? I have a great one! The PJ masks, they're over by those trees behind you. Drop the cat boys in, get them. Stop, tin cans! I'm nearly out! Trap! Okay, Catboys, let's use your log inventions. Hello. Oh, ouch. Oh, ouch. Yay! Here comes the rest. Let's take our places. Come on, robot. What are you PJ Pests up to? Super cat speed! Grab that cat, robot! Get off me! We did it! Now get those gecko muscles ready! But if I pull out the glowy thing, you'll disappear! We won't disappear! We'll just be one cat boy together again! Now that's a team! Do it, gecko! Super gecko muscles! this thing up with the other one. PJ Masks, I'll shout hooray! Cause, Cause it is a nice day! day. Huh? Uh -huh. Who'd play with you? You are PJ Masks. Or I'm turning your school into my very own Night Ninja Ninja Night School <laughs> at night! <laughs> well, what happens if we win? Like you could. But if you did win, I'd leave your school. If you lose, though, I stay here. And get your HQ. No way. Forget it. You're on. <gasps> First to capture the other's flag and get it back to their base wins. <laughs> With my gecko sense, we're totally going to win this. It'll be easy peasy lizard squeezy. Are you sure about this gecko sense? You have lots of other really cool powers. But they're not good for capture the flag. Not like Super Gecko Sense. That's perfect! Ready to play Capture the Flag, PJ Losers? Then let the game begin! One of us had better stay here to keep watch on our flag. With your amazing owl eyes, you'd be perfect for the job. 
So who goes to the school? You, Catboy. Your incredible cat ears can listen for Night Ninja. Between your allies and my cat ears, there's no way he can sneak past us. You're forgetting my super gecko sense. It'll tell me where Night Ninja is. He's, um, inside the school, planning how to get our flag. But that means he isn't watching his. So now's our time to grab it. I thought your super gecko sense only told you when danger was near. Uh, near, far, whatever. It can sense pretty much anything. Okay. Come on, let's get his flag. You'd better stay here and guard our flag just in case. Have a Ninjalino school patrol to get past. But no night ninja. My super gecko sense was right. He's inside. Time to grab that flag. Super lizard grip! Super gecko muscles! Sorry, guys. I should have put the rock in HQ like you said. But I didn't. And the rock ended up nearly getting you. It's okay. We got away. And HQ's fixed. But you were in danger. Everyone's in danger, as long as that rock's around. You might be right about that. Prepare for shock and awe. <laughs> if we use this, the rock will hit even harder. No way. It's time to be a hero. We've had enough trouble with that rock. There's no stopping me, lizard boy. The medallion will be mine. <laughs> here! Super Gecko Muscles! Wow! That was a really super strong move. Yeah, I don't know what got into me. Suddenly I felt stronger than ever. That's because you wanted to save us from danger, Gecko. And it brought every bit of super strength out of you. You're right! Give that medallion back! It's mine! No way is that yours, Night Ninja! But I broke the rock. I threw it at your HQ. You threw it, but Gecko was the one who broke it with his super strength. Oh, but that makes no sense. How can a lizard be stronger than I am? It's because true strength comes from caring and helping your friends. Where's the fun in that? Fine. You peewee masks can keep it but I'll be back when you least expect me. I'm sending you back to that ancient mountain temple for more training, Ninjalinos. <laughs> you definitely deserve that medallion, Gecko. Thanks, but it's from far away, and there's a legend all about it. Who needs a medallion anyways? I'm giving it to the museum so everyone can see it. Cool. And maybe there's another way you can prove your strength before we're done. Muscle, shout hooray! Cause in the night we save the day! Looking, looking, nothing here. Wait, Alex, the marks from the missing train tracks are here. Remember? So if we follow them, we'll find the train. Yes, let's go, let's go! Oh. Was that Romeo's lab? It looked like it, Gecko, but it was all over the place. Maybe there's a... Guys, never mind Romeo. If he's in his lab, he can't be driving that train, and we need to find out who is. Go, go, go! Uh, okay. Okay. Tracks. How will we find the tree now? How will I? I see something up ahead. Something fast. That's it. The train. See? I told you it was fast. Now let's see who's driving. Romeo? Well, hello, PJ Masks. But we just saw you driving your lab. That wasn't me. No one's driving my lab. Silly thing short-circuited and took off by itself. Good thing I've got this super-fast trip. Oh, look what the cat dragged in! <laughs> Stop, you kooky cat! Time to drop in! You're being silly! You'll crash! Unless it's another trick. And it is!
Don't worry, I'm okay. Hmm. I'm tired of only having one PJ mask voice. Time to get all three. <gasps> no, I'm losing my voice. He's taking our voice. Does this mean that Romeo the genius has all of our voices? It's because he's so awesome. But we're not. Without our voices, we'll never be able to work together to defeat him. And all because Gecko didn't take his voice back when he could. R-O-M-E-O, -E Romeo! Oh, what's that, Gecko? Oh, you think it's time to be a hero. Ego treat you, loopy lizard! all the naughty things I can do with these voices. And those PJ Pests will get the blame! Oh, this is even more genius than I thought! Huh? Why am I stopping? Maybe there's something wrong with the engine. I'm going to cover the city with huge sticky splats. <gasps> one for the school, one for the museum, and let's not forget the park. People will be talking about it forever. And cleaning it up forever, too. Wriggling reptiles! Those are big! Don't worry, Gecko. Leave this to me. Ha! So that's what you've been doing in your spare time? Being a villain is more than a hobby. These sticky splats aren't just big. My new formula makes them bouncy. So they'll be even better! <laughs> what do you mean, not bad enough? Uh. You've got a better, better idea? We'll see about that. Sticky splats away! You guys go after the other two. I have a much better idea. Wait, my best save ever, remember? Here it comes. Super Cat Leap! A little balls isn't awesome, but stuffing one big one is. This is totally going in the record books. <gasps> Look out, Catboy! <gasps> oh no, my cat car! I just washed that. <laughs> Dare you scribble on my beautiful work of art? Go and wipe it off right now! Oh. Now, are you finished hiding all the other art inside the museum? Good. Soon I'll get rid of it forever! So that's his plan. Hide all the other art so all that's left is the statue of him. Not if I can help it. After what he did to my sculpture, messing with his will be the perfect way to get even. Wait! He didn't mean for your sculpture to get broken. He said it was an accident! After our Nindalinos! Outlet, why'd you do that? I didn't do it on purpose, but it serves him right. That's what he did to my statue. Oh, no! no! Not my sculpture! My beautiful art! It's broken! Destroyed! <laughs> oh, he's really upset. Like you were when your sculpture was broken. I guess now he knows how you feel. Except seeing him upset doesn't make me feel better at all. I thought it'd be fair to make him pay. But two wrongs don't make a right? No, they really don't. <laughs> Night Ninja, I'm really sorry. Maybe we can fix it? No, you've ruined it! So now I'm going to ruin everyone else's art! <laughs> Enough! 
enough, Ninja Latos! I know this is all my fault, but your sculpture still looks good. Yeah, it really looks like you, minus the hand. Yeah, you must have put a lot of work into it. And it shows. Forget it. It's only good for one thing now. Destroying the museum. Push it over, Ninjalinos! <laughs> no, Ninjalinos, don't do that! The seeds, they've been released, and it's all my fault. Too bad, PJ Pest. Gasping geckos! They're growing! Everywhere! Luna Girl's going to get her moon garden. It'll grow over the whole city and destroy all the other plants. I couldn't have done it without you. <laughs> She's right. I should have asked you to help. But I wanted to show I knew about gardening, even though I didn't go to that club. It's okay, Owlette. Any ideas now? I'm listening. I really am. Thinking, thinking. Those seeds are everywhere. Oh! <sighs> they just go wherever the wind blows. Wait, that's a great idea, Gecko. Wherever the wind blows. All we have to do is get the wind blowing in the right direction. I know what to do, but I'm going to need all the gardening help I can get. What's the plan? Come with me. It's time to be a hero! Ready, Gecko? It's time for Operation Weed Wind! for a big white ball sucking up toys. It can be anywhere. Tickets for PJ Masks statues who can't clap. You won't get away with this. Really? But here I am, getting away right now. Bye bye. To the left. To the right. Huh? Hmm. 
I'll get you unstuck. Oh. Thanks, Owlette. The nasty ninja! Please calm down, Catboy. What we need is a plan. Yeah, stay cool like Master Faye. He never gets angry. Yeah, well, that's because nobody ever stole his sword before. I bet he's just as angry as I am right now. Come on, let's go, go, go! Look, that's Master Fang's dojo. It's the place where he teaches his kung fu classes and does his TV show. Whoa, his sword really is awesome. Look at all those beautiful jewels on it. Yeah, there's one for every year of his training. <laughs> Catboy? Oh. Okay. Why don't you get Night Ninja's attention? While you camouflage and sneak up on him, I'll swoop in and... Oh. I can't stand him using Master Fang's sword. He stole it! Right, but... Catboy, no! Gasping geckos! You'll never be as good as Master Fang, Night Ninja! Give that sword back! Oh, showtime! Come back here! What can we do? Oh, quick! Let's go help Catboy! Where is it? Must have lost it somewhere. Got you! I'm ah. sure I had it in my pocket. Huh? Oh. Romeo, what have you done with my friends? They're here. But they work for me now. What? Outlet! Gecko! Get away from Romeo! Negative. We will only obey Romeo now. <laughs> Something weird's going on. Huh? <gasps> Nothing to see here. Oh, yeah? Let's shine some light on this mystery. Fireballs! <gasps> what? Red, Amaya! They grabbed us when we were all playing outside. It was easy without their superpowers. But if you're in those cages, who are they? Keep away from them, Catboy! Wait, the picture player said robots. That's not Gecko and Outlet at all. Yeah! No, but you thought it was when it was really my incredible robot copies. And if I hadn't lost my circuit board, you would have been one of them too. A circuit board? You mean this? My circuit board. Don't be too confident, kitty cat. Soon my Robo Owl and Robo Gecko will put you in a cage too. Then I'll rule the world and you'll never stop me again. <laughs> Catboy, free us so we can help you. Not without your powers. Don't worry, I'll get your pajamas. Looking for these, kitty little boy? Oh! Yes, your pajamas are mine, and so are you! Uh. Whoa. Uh. These robots have the same powers as Owlette and Gecko? Oh no, much better. Just watch this. Whoa! Extra powers? That's not fair! I warned you. It took years to build a supercomputer to power them, but now my robots are unstoppable. Ah! Are you okay, Robot? I've never been better because I've suddenly decided to take over the world. Huh? What? But taking over the world's my thing! Not anymore. Hey, put me down! Take over the world. What happened? She used to be so nice. Romeo said he hadn't worked out all the bugs. When I hit her, I must have scrambled her circuits and turned her bad. Sorry, guys. No, we are sorry. This is our fault. If we had let you join us while we were Master Fang and Kick McGee, this wouldn't have happened. Catboy's right. If you still feel like playing Flossy Flash, we'd be happy to have you on our team. Deal. Now let's go stop Robet, save Romeo, and get the playground equipment back. Romeo, I am coming. I thought you guys weren't friends anymore. Negative. I was just jealous he was spending all his time with the unit he calls Robet. So that's why you took the equipment. You were jealous. If we help you save Romeo, will you put it back? Affirmative. Great, because I have a plan. It's time to be a hero. Or should I say, heroes? Take over the world. 
Robets, Master Fang and Kick McGee are on the case. Now drop Romeo. Never. It's over. You want him? Catch. Flossy <gasps> Flash Super Catch. Gotcha. Got it. But why did she just drop it? By my cat's whiskers, she's up to something. Or maybe she's just clumsy. Come on, let's return it. Then I can get back to Birdie. of HQ outlet. Birdie, why did you do this? Huh? Maybe because you left her alone. Lionel always makes a mess when I don't pay enough attention to him. Hmm. I thought pets were supposed to be fun. They are fun, but they need exercise and training and lots of... Huh? It's Luna Girl again. She's at the zoo. Okay, PJ Masks, let's go. But what about Birdie? I know, she can come too. She'll get lots of exercise and I'll train her as we go. You can't take a pet on a mission. She'll be fine, won't you, Birdie? Shoo, shoo! Stop it, Luna girl. Let those butterflies go home. Oh my, it's the PJ Pest coming to spoil my fun again. Quick, Moth, let's get out of here. Weird. She isn't usually that easy to scare off. Come on, you can go back in now. Birdie, you're scaring them. Go and wait for me in the owl glider. Birdie only wants some attention. Does that mean Owlette keeps leaving you alone? Well, you pulled off phase one of my plan. I think you're ready for phase two. Luna power! Make two more mini Luna crystals. Put these in Owlette and Gecko's room so I can take control of HQ. Don't let me down, bird. Home sweet home, little butterflies. Yeah! Aww. What? Goodbye, tire bridge. All right, now we're spinning. Wait, what? Let's do it again. Whoa! Ugh. Enough playing around, PJ Masks. Soon, only one fortress will be left standing. The best fortress, mine! Oh no, now he can cross the tire bridge. This is all my fault. Night Ninja's fortress has all these new things, and when I saw them, I wanted them too. <sighs> you guys were right. We don't need new things just because someone else has them. That's okay, Owlette. I'm sure there's something we already have that can stop him. We'll get the school buses back. There is something we can use to stop him. A few somethings. It's time to be a hero. Yeah! Who has the best base? You do, Night Ninja. We don't even have a base anymore. Ours got squished. <laughs> A giant furball? What are they trying to do? Gross me out? Nice shot, Catboy! Thanks, Gecko. Owlette, you're sure we only need to hit three of the buses on the bottom with furballs? Just three. And when we yank them out of position, the rest of the buses will all come loose. How do you like that, Night Ninja? Here's a couple more for you. Lab? 
No, silly cat. He is. I'm not getting it for you. Yes, you are. <laughs> not tickling. Okay, okay. Stop tickling, Catboy, and we'll do whatever you want. Now, Pussycat and Birdbrain, start building my satellite tower. While you do the work, I'll finish my radical Romeo remote. Hmm. Okay, I've got a plan. Romeo put the small remote in his backpack. While I distract him, you sneak up behind him and take it out. Not bad. But with my idea, we get the big remote. You distract him, and I'll sneak into the lab and grab it. I think it's safer my way. I'm sure I saw Romeo doing something to the lab doors earlier. It could be a trap. Don't worry about that. I'm team leader, so I'm in control. Okay. Romeo, can you help me, please? What is it, bird brain? This tower! Which poles are for the cross pieces? And just how tall should it be? Uh-oh, an alarm! Wait, I have an idea! Super cat speed! Oops! <gasps> What's going on? Trying to fool me, eh? Well, I'll just have to make you work a little bit harder. No! Catboy! I knew this would happen! Uh, stop controlling me, Romeo! Oh, I do hate to hear my workers complain. So I'm putting you on mute! Oh, no! Much better. Now get to work! In Fast Forward. Now for the dish. Great job, lizard legs. And now, Pussycat, bring me my new Radical Romeo remote. Find my cat's whiskers! Flying machine out of action. Just a few more, then I'll be the only and the best liar in the sky. Way better than you, bird brain. <laughs> what did he mean about being the only flyer in the sky? <gasps> Maybe he's going to steal the hot air balloon from the air show, too. And everything else in the city that flies. Owlette, chase him. But the owl glider's broken. You don't need the owl glider. You're a great flyer without it. I can't. What do you mean? I mean, he's too good. I'm not as good a flyer as he is. What? You're an amazing flyer. It's not your fault he wrecked the owl glider with his splat grabber things. Yeah, and we can help. Let's take the owl glider back to HQ, then make a trip to the museum. The museum had this old plane. Cool, huh? Whoa! Whoa! Phew. You're doing great. You'll definitely catch Night Ninja. But you're the PJ Mask flying expert, so we'll follow your lead. My lead? But. Hmm. <gasps> there they are! They're going to splat grab the hot air balloon! Okay, Outlet, how do we fly in to stop them? Uh, well, uh, tell us what to do. We can't let Night Ninja take anything else that flies. I... Uh... Okay, don't worry. We'll try. Hold 
onto one of my feet. And when I shout fly, Gecko, you grab the other. Okay, here comes Supersonic Owlette. Ready, set. One more minute. Hand it over. I am almost finished this level. Catboy, you keep an eye on Romeo and Robot while I quietly fly Gecko to the PJ Picture Player and drop him in. Right. Then I deactivate the rocket in Super Gecko Camouflage. Someone's using a microphone. Super Cat Jump! Super Owl Wing! Super Laser Grip! I'm coming with you. That's what best friends are for. What? Super Gecko Camouflage. as a shield. I'm using it as a mirror. Hey, Romeo, you couldn't hit me if I was 10 feet tall. Mm. Bullseye! Mm. Ah! No! My anti-grounding machine! Come back! Go, get grab it! No! Oh, yes! Flip the switch, Catboy! Time for things to get a little more. Early 
again. <sighs> I just don't get it. Let's try again. Maybe you'll get it right this time. Don't worry. I've got it. I just don't think we need that move. Don't need it? But it could stop Romeo. If he's got a big plan, we need a big move. I have big moves already. Super wing power and flying twirl. Let's go to the owl glider. Wait, this new move could be awesome. Too bad I can't do it. <laughs> By my cat's whiskers! It's his robot and his Leboggin and his super train! Take us in for a landing outlet. Ha! PJ Masks! What a surprise! Come to watch me take over the world! Like you haven't tried that before. Not like this. I bought all my favorite machines for a giant attack. Not if we stop you first, Romeo. Like you could stop all my machines at once. My robot will zap you with the go slow way and then fill your HQ with stink. And while you're busy with that, my Leboggin will ice your vehicles. No more PJ peskiness forever. No way, Romeo. <laughs> And let's not forget my train. I'll race it so fast the whole city will be smashed. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Aww. Romeo's gone. Up here, Featherbrain. I'm flying. With my power copier, I've copied your powers. Whoa. <laughs> and you're not the only one. Ooh. You must have absorbed Owlet's powers, too! What? No one uses my powers but me! I hope you have landing gear, Romeo, cause you're going down! That's for sure! <laughs> I'll be seeing you later, Catboy and Gecko! Oh, for a copy of your powers! He's getting away! Let's fly! I'm okay! Me too! Mm -hmm. Phew! Flying is my power. I know how to use it and would have caught Romeo if you didn't get in the way. Just use your own powers. But with double powers, we'll be able to stop him in half the time. Yeah, plus flying is so fun. We've never been able to do this before. You guys gonna chase me or what? <laughs> Come on, PJ Masks! Let's find Romeo. Why don't I fly and you two look from the ground? But we can see so much further from up here. Plus, this is way more fun. Yeah! I can't see Romeo anywhere. Are you using owl eyes? Yeah, but I call it cat eyes. You have my owl eyes power too? Ooh, let me try. Gecko vision! Oh, I see Romeo! No. I think I got him! Nope. There he is! Oops. How do you use owl eyes to see things super close up? Ah! Don't worry. Nothing's gonna distract me this time. You again? Time for me to slow you down, little bird! We'll see about that, Romeo. this time. You almost hit me, Master. Oh, stop complaining and help me catch her. Just a little faster. I have to distract Romeo until Gecko stops that clock. But Master, I already caught her. Complaining again? The important thing is that we've slowed down Birdbrain. 
Catch me if you can, Romeo! Super Cat Speed! Stop distracting me! I have a city to slow down! You again? Well, you're not distracting me this time. Super Cat Jump! Okay, they liked being Alatinis at first, and they were definitely mad at Night Ninja. So, maybe they could still help us. But help us get the job done, not just help me have fun. It's time to be a hero! Stop, Night Ninja! Give that chariot back! No way! It's mine now! Just like these Ninjalinos! They'll never do as you say! Ninjalinos, I'm sorry. I really am. <laughs> I'm not your leader. I'm just someone who needs your help. Aw, boo-hoo. Spare us the sob story, Birdie. Pay no attention to her. I'm your leader. What? What's happening? We're too heavy! All of you jump out! Now! Afraid of your ninjas? You'll be fine. Now jump! No, he's asking them to jump. <laughs> we have to save him. <laughs> gotcha. There. Okay, now. <laughs> Did 
I do that? Catboy! I can't hold it much longer! Hang on, Outlet! I'm coming! Cat roar! I suppose you're gonna blame me for that, Lizard Legs? <laughs> no! I have to stop blaming you. This isn't your fault, it's mine. It's time to be a hero. And heroes take the blame for what they've done and fix it. Super Gecko Muscles! Phew! It's my fault that Luna Girl has Cameron's car. I left it out all night. It's okay, Gecko. We'll help you get it back. Luna Girl's getting the party started. Let's go! Thanks for the invite, Luna Girl. Welcome to my party. Wait, are those the school loudspeakers? Yep. You borrowed our school's dance stuff? I didn't borrow it. I stole it for our dance party. You're welcome, PJ Pests. That's no way to talk to your guests. Guests? <laughs> no, guests can leave anytime they want. But you guys, well, you'll know what I mean when you see this. <laughs> What? You're trapped, PJ Party Poopers! There's no way out of my Lunar Dome! And I thought you wanted to make up. Nope, sorry. Oh, and this dome? It goes round you, over you, and down a long way, too. And while you're trapped, I'll take everything else from the school dance. What? I don't want anyone else having dance fun. It's going to be just me at my party. <laughs> Feathers. The dance-off will be canceled if she steals all the stuff. We'll never get to do our cool moves. Gasping geckos, I really wanted to do my robot. There's no way we're going to let Luna Girl ruin everyone's fun. We have to get out of here. I've got this. Super Gecko Muscles! <laughs> I can't move it. And I can't fly out. And she said the dome goes way down, so we can't go under. Unless you do a super fast spin. You could tunnel us under the dome. That's a great idea. It would be like the spinning tornado dance move, Catboy. I guess it is a bit like that. It would just take some practice. No way am I messing up again. That was embarrassing. Let's think of another idea. You'll be fine. We'll show you again. Come on. Stand on your tippy toes. Lift a leg. And now swing. <laughs> <laughs> Romeo took every single book. I'll fix him with the velocity flash. Kick and crash. <laughs> it's a bit more crash than flash outlet. What's <laughs> wrong with your own amazing moves? They're okay, but a flash flip will really surprise Romeo once I get it right. Okay, let's figure out where Romeo will go next. Where are there lots of books? Uh... Huh? The, the city, city library! Wriggling reptiles! It's got some of the most precious books in the world! We have to stop him! <laughs> all right! <laughs> Come on! Romeo might steal all the Flossy Flash books from the library, too! <gasps> Every book in the city will be about me. <laughs> You're one of my best inventions yet. Thank you, Master. I love Romeo. Romeo is a genius. Last stop, the library. <laughs> Excellent. The door's still locked. Romeo's in here yet. Gecko, you climb up high. Once I tie up his feet, you jump down and knock over the robot. Okay, Catboy. Super Lizard Grip! Super Gecko Camouflage! Owlette, use your owl eyes to warn us when they're near. It's really important. Don't worry, Catboy. I'm on it. Super Owl Wing! Okay, I'll wait for your signal. 
Glossy Flash scanned the city. There was no way she'd miss seeing that villain. And he was no match for her flash flip. Kick and crash! <gasps> everyone's chimneys with my incredible sniffle whiff. Everyone will be so busy trying to unstink themselves, no one will stop me from taking over the world! That'll be a catastrophe! <laughs> PJ Masks, we need to stop those boxing gloves! Super Chat Jump! <laughs> and I'll stop Romeo from seeing what we're doing. Hey, what are you doing out there? You'll know soon enough, Romeo. <laughs> with a bit of a redesign. Super Gecko Muscles! Yeah! Oops. Whoa. Watch out, Gecko! <gasps> He's slipping! Super Lizard Grip! Cool chameleons, look! This piece of Romeo's bulldozer makes a great pogo stick! Okay, but it's not as funny without a tiny cat boy. Hey, maybe I should shrink you, Ninja Lanos, too. <laughs> Stop that! Oh, you don't even know which buttons to press. Well, you can't point the shrinky hose. Yes, I can. Can't. Can too. Your time is up. Hand over that 
shrinky hose villain, shrink that feather brain flapper. And grab that lizard, Ninjalino. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 